from this Sunday, we praise this all together. And I love you, Lord, and I lift my voice to worship you. Let's praise it together. And I love you, Lord, and I love you, Lord, and I lift my voice to worship you, oh, my soul. Joy, my King, and watch you hear. Let it be a sweet, sweet sound in your ears. Pressing that I love you. I love you, Lord, and I lift my voice to worship you, oh, my soul, rejoice, take joy, my King. that once again and I love you Lord I love you Lord and I live and I lift my voice to worship you oh my soul rejoice Take joy, my King, in what you hear. Let it be a sweet, sweet, let it be a sweet, let it be a sweet, sweet, let it be. Let it be a sweet, sweet sound in your ear. Amen. All right, let's say to each other, succeed in worship. All right, let's all stand up. All right, week number two of study camp is in the books. How was it? How was week one? Week one was bad? Oh, man. How was week two? Oh, how, how will week three be? Good? Better? So we went from bad, good, better to best? And then most bestest? Will there be a final week? All right, guys. Uh, let's gather our hearts. Let's praise this next one together, okay? We owe. Johnny, did you memorize the body worship? All right, come here. Why don't you come and help me? I think you can do it, Johnny. Come on. Okay, together. All right. Johnny, this side. Both of you guys can stand over here. Since you guys are all over there. Can't you guys clap in unison? All right, let's start from we owe, we owe. 
We are, we are with the man you will one this be with God, we will enjoy him. We are, we are with the man you will one this sinking and says inside that we, we are, we are, we are, we are with the man you will one this be with God, we will enjoy him. We are, we are, with the man you are, one this sinking at says, inside there we will find, with he is, with he is, with me every moment always, Emmanuel, who, you and me every moment forevermore, oneness, he is with every all thing. Oh, yeah, mighty Father, thank you. Praise you, Jesus. We are, we are, we are with the man you will one this being with God. We will enjoy him. We are, we are with the man you will one this seeking at says inside there. We all find we are, we are, we are. With the man you will one this being with God, we will enjoy him. We are, we are with the man you will one this seeking and says inside there we will find every everything I have found in everything, everything I have found in. Everything I have found in him. We are, we are, we are, we are with the man you will one this being with God. We will enjoy him. We are, we are with the man you will one this seeking at says inside there we will for we are, we are, we are. With the man you will one this being with God, we will enjoy him. We are, we are with the man you will one this seeking at says inside there we will find. Amen. All right, you boys can go back to your seats now. I promise. I will learn the rest of these praises and master them to sing with you guys on Sunday. That's a promise. All right. You guys ready? B. B. Is B good? I think B is fine. All right, here we go. Did you feel the mountains tremble? Did you feel the mountains tremble? Did you hear the oceans roar? When the people rose to sing of Jesus Christ, the risen one. Did you feel the people tremble? Did you hear the Michael? When the lost began to sing of Jesus Christ, the saving one. Let's do that again. Did you feel, did you feel the mountains tremble? Did you hear the sea oceans roar? When the people rose to sing of Jesus Christ, the risen one. Let's clap in unison. Did you feel, did you feel the people tremble? Did you hear the singers roar? When the lost began to sing of Jesus Christ, the saving one. And we can, we can see God, you're moving 
A mighty river through the nations, young and old, my God, to Jesus. Fling wide to heavenly gates, prepare the way of the risen Lord. Open up, open up the doors and let the music play. Let the streets resound with singing Songs that bring your hope Songs that bring your joy Dancers to dance upon injustice Do you, do you feel the darkness tremble? When all saints join in one song, all the streams flow as one river. Wash away our brokenness. And can you, we can see, can see that God, you're moving a mighty river through the nations. Young and old will turn to Jesus. Fling wide to heavenly gates, prepare the way of the risen Lord. We can, we can see that God is moving a mighty river through the nations. Young and old return to Jesus. Fling wide, fling wide to heavenly gates. Prepare the way of the risen Lord. Open, open up the doors and let the music play. Let the streets resound with singing. Songs that bring your home. Songs that bring your joy, dancers to dance upon injustice. We can, we can see that God, you moving a mighty river through the nations. Young and old will turn to Jesus. Fling wide to heavenly gates. Prepare the way of the risen Lord. Amen. All right, you guys can all sit down. All right. Let's praise this one once again, okay? And let's close our eyes and let's praise it, okay? I love you, Lord, and I lift my voice to worship you, okay? Think about every single lyric you say, okay? Praise, praise every lyric, every word to God, okay? So think about every single word, and I want you to close your eyes and let's praise it together. I love you, Lord, and I love you, Lord, and I lift my voice to worship you, oh, my soul, rejoice, take joy my king and watch you I let my 
my voice to worship you, O oh, my soul, rejoice, take joy, my King, and watch you. Let it be a sweet, sweet. Let it be, let it be a sweet, sweet sound in your ear. Let it be a sweet, let it be a sweet. Sweet sound in your ear. Let's close our eyes. God, we thank you. May today's worship be one that is a sweet, sweet sound to your ear. May you see the heart of all of our worship today, Lord. May this worship be one where there is zero unbelief. May it be one where our scars and our thoughts, our ways, our spiritual problems, the things that we desire can all be laid down uh, and one that can truly uh, be able to worship you because you are the triune God who is living and active, where the word of God is increasing, where we are to be ones uh, that can truly live for evangelism missions, Lord. Uh, during this time of worship, may the remnants become your spiritual summits. May they be sensitive to the time of worship. May they be able to hear your voice, receive your grace, and be able to imprint only Jesus, only the gospel inside of the lives. May you break down all the force of darkness once again. Uh, in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Okay. I want you guys to keep your eyes closed. And I want you guys to break down all the force of darkness. Confess that Jesus is the Christ before Teacher Jen comes up. Person who is blessed. Three, two, one. May I delight only in the law of the Lord today as well and be the one who meditates on your law day and night. Law of the Lord, three, two, one. The love of the Lord is perfect, reviving the soul. The testimony of the Lord is sure, making wise and simple. The precepts of the Lord are right, rejoicing the heart. The commandment of the Lord is pure, lightening the eyes. The fear of the Lord is clean, enduring forever. The rules of the Lord are true and righteous altogether. More to be desired are they than gold, even much fine gold. Sweeter also than honey and drippings of the honeycomb. Moreover, by them is your servant warned. Keeping them there is great reward. Let the words of my mouth and the meditations of my heart be acceptable in your sight, O Lord, my rock and my redeemer. Pray for friends and missions, which you want. May I be consumed with the words today as well and testify that Jesus is the Christ. Michael, where's your prayer book? Where's your other backpack? You sure you have it? Okay. On Sunday, right? Okay. Jesus' life, Jesus' power, Jesus' healing, Jesus' witness. Raise a banner for the nations. Johnny, next to teacher Christina. Go on to the covenant and pray. Experience God's five time schedules. Restoration to Christ. Platform, pass through the gates. Prepare the way. Build up the highway. Remove the stones. For his benefit the nations, Jesus, our salvation. Watchtower, God posted us as watchmen on the walls, never silent, day or night. No rest. Give God no rest. Antenna, communicate with God as his holy people, redeemed of the Lord, sought after, city no longer deserted. Blessing of 24, past, present, future, Saul. My 24, church 24. And field 24, spiritual summit first. Today's message is the start of all works.
pencil, Johnny Pencil. The start of all works, the start of everything. Whatever we start, we start with. What did uh, Pastor Yo? Yeah, worship and prayer. Can I move on? Acts 13, 1 to 3. Everybody there? No Bibles? You forgot it at the the barbecue place? Barnabas and Saul sent off. In the church at Antioch, there were prophets and teachers. Barnabas, Simeon called Niger, Lucius of Cyrene, Manaean, who had been brought up with Herod the Tetrarch, and Saul. While they were worshiping the Lord and fasting, the Holy Spirit said, Set apart for me Barnabas and Saul for the work to which I have called them. So after they had fasted and prayed, they placed their hands on them and sent them off. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Today's lesson objective, to start everything with the manual. The start of everything is a manual. To start everything with a manual. Manual means God with us. I feel like I've seen you remnant a couple hours ago. Deja vu. David vu. Banshiki. Nice words. Moving on. You guys ready for a pop quiz? Trivia night. How should we start? Let's see. Oh, baby Paul. No. Brushing your teeth. How should you? What do you? What's the first step? First step when you brush your teeth. Thank you so much for raising your hand. Banshiki. Just grab the toothbrush. Anybody else? What's your first step when brushing your teeth, Michael? You wash the tooth? Oh, okay. Yeah, I do that too. All right. Yeah, you wash it. Wash the toothbrush. Who knows? Maybe flies were on it overnight. Right? Who knows? Your little brother might have put it in the toilet. Never know. You got to wash it first. What about... Tying your shoes, putting on your shoes. <laughs> That's got IQ zero. <laughs> Why would you put your foot up to t and then tie the other shoe? <laughs> <laughs> What's the first step when you put on your shoes? Okay, how about, what's the first step when tying your shoes? Let's say you already have the, the shoe on. You just make bunny ears immediately? But what if the rest of the tooth, I mean, the shoelace is loose? No, you tug it first. Yeah, you tug it first, right? Make sure it's uh, fitting. First step. What about uh, making coffee or to get coffee? What's the first step to get coffee, to get some coffee? Thank you for raising your elbow. Thank you for raising your hand. Paul, you get red beans, okay? You get a coffee maker, okay? You put, you put taco into the hot water. Johnny? You put juice in it, okay? No, you just go to Starbucks. Easy. Easy, right? You go inside and they give you coffee. What about, oh, oh my gosh. What about if you get a phone and then the language is changed? What's the first step to change the language? For some, it's in Korean or Chinese, Mandarin, Russian. 
Urdu. Benji, you go to YouTube. You go to YouTube to figure out how to change it. Emma? Yeah, you just go to settings. You go to settings and then you look around. <laughs> Even though the settings is probably in a different language too. What about, what if you see coyotes in public? Thank you for raising your hand. Michael. You go to Star, you run away and go to Starbucks, okay. What about if you see coyote, like right in front of you, it's facing you? You punch it, it's gonna bite you. Johnny? You run over it with a car? <laughs> no, you make loud noises and you make yourself look super big. Right? Rah! Start screaming. You guys are good at screaming. Oh, yeah. yeah, and you make yourself look really big and coyote will get scared. Right? Sometimes there's maybe two coyotes or three coyotes. Then you act even more crazy. And you pray for mobilization of angels. <laughs> What about, oh yeah, you make yourself look big. Ah. What about getting into a car? What's the first thing you do when you go inside of your car? Yeah? After you do that, after you go inside your car, what's the first thing you do? You put in your keys right away, okay, Michael? Sit down. You sit, oh, say you're already inside and you're already seated. Johnny? No, you don't go broom, broom. Emma? Seatbelt, okay, so you just leave the door open. No, first step is to close the door, right? You don't, and, then, and then lock it, make sure, nobody, no, make sure nobody runs up and tries to open it again, right? You probably live in safe neighborhoods. Me too. But sometimes in Chicago, not safe, not safe. What about, what's the first thing you do, say you got fouled in a basketball game, what's the first thing you do when you're shooting a free throw? Yeah? You go like this first? Bajigi? You just throw the ball in the hole? No, you, put your, you line up your feet on the line. Make sure your foot's behind the line, first step. What about when you go inside of a dark room? What's the first thing you do? I didn't call on you. Michael. Turn on the light. Yeah, you look around for the light. Yeah, you just turn on the light first. You don't go inside of a dark room and just start dancing. Actually, some, some remnants might do that. I could think of one. There's this one brave remnant. While the boys were playing soccer, this remnant just walked across the soccer game back and forth. What about, what's the first thing you do when you go inside of your house? Yeah? Open the door. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Okay, so after, you go, after you open the door and after you close the door. Okay, Bashki, yeah, you take off your shoe. What about when you're doing a sketch? What's the first thing, what's the first thing people do when they're Drawing a sketch. Michael? Yeah, your supplies. Say you already, you already did that. What's the first thing you draw? Emma? Like a sketch of the No. I thought you were an expert. Bajiki? Yeah, you draw a circle. Yeah. Okay, Bajiki. Yeah, you just draw the circle. You, so you start with the head. Bajiki, if you, okay, what about making tuna sandwich? What was the first thing we did when we made tuna sandwich in BBS? Benji? Before you massage the tuna, Benji massage it too much. It turned into sludge, sludge, tuna slime, yeah? Okay, you drain out the tuna juice, Bajiki, you remember. Okay. What about putting in gas? What's the first thing you do when you go to gas station? Michael? Oh, so it's just, it's closed, but you just jam it in there. You're going to scratch your car. Bajiki? How do you open the gas, the gas door in your car? Do you guys know? Oh, I know. Oh, you just push it and it opens? No, there's a secret button hidden under the wheel. 
You pull it, and then the gas door opens. First step. Okay, now I'm gonna show you a video. Guys, stop. I'm gonna show you a video where these people did not have the correct start. If you laugh, you lose. <laughs> Michael, stop passing gas. Correct start? Incorrect start. Disqualified. He worked, like, what, like, four, eight years, and he lost. Disqualified. Disqualified. What about racing? Epic false starts in sports. Who is that? Fastest man. Disqualified. You know, he's fastest man on earth, right? Nine point something second, 100 meter dash. Incorrect start. He can't even show off his skills. But that, let's, let's review what we learned last Friday. And then we'll talk about Paul and Mr. Barney who had correct start. Okay, last week we talked about Peter. Peter, Peter was in prison. And then what happened to Peter? I don't know. Yeah, no, angel. The church was praying for Peter and God sent angel. Did he wake up the first time? Wake up. No, so the angel had to kick him on the side. Put on your clothes, follow me. And then the doors just opened and the, the chains just loosened. Peter thought he was in a dream or he was in a trance. And then he realized it was Angel. He went to the house where the church was gathered, and the servant girl named Rhoda, did she open the door? Oh my gosh, it's Peter! And just left Peter standing there. Angry Peter. Beep, 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 beep. It's Peter. Peter's at the door. Oh my gosh, it's him, it's him. Oh no, it must be his angel. Meanwhile, Peter's just outside. Then they brought Peter, and then Peter told them what happened, and then left to do more ministry. King Herod found out Peter was, was missing, and then he interrogated all the soldiers, and then he put them to death by the sword. And then what happened to King Herod? <laughs> to keep this short and sweet, he was eaten by worm. He was eaten by a worm. He didn't give glory to God because people are like, wow, this is the voice of a God. And he's like, yeah. And then he died. <laughs> Can't block God. And God's word increased. Let's get rid of our misconceptions. Just like people, people thought they could use their big brain to get what they want. King Herod thought he was God, the master. Both misconceptions. Now before, Paul and Mr. Barney were sent out as missionaries. They gathered in the church. 
Anybody remember what's the name of the church? It's a church where they called, they called believers of Christ Christians for the first time. Emma, thank you for raising your hand. Please spell Antioch. Emma. That is correct. Security. Get this disruptive bunch of out of here. Start of all works. Yeah, they, got, they gathered at the church of Antioch. There were prophets and teachers. Pastors and teachers? There was Mr. Barney, Mr. Simeon, Mr. Lucius, Mr. Mann, Mr. Mayonnaise, and Mr. Paulito. What a wonderful name. And they worship together. What's worship consist of? Word. Prayer. Praise. Fellowship. Offering. What pee pee of? See, they started with worship and fasting. Fasting was where they didn't eat to receive guidance of Holy Spirit. Word. Prayer. Praise. Offering. Fellowship. Whoop. Whoopee. Start by focusing on God's word. And then the Holy Spirit said, set apart Mr. Paulito and Mr. Barney. I don't know why Spotlight is over here. I should have moved Barney over here. And then they were set out, sent off at the first missionaries. They placed their, their hands on them and then sent them off. There's remnants who can't keep their hands to themselves, right? even during study camp. All the time touching. Maybe they're praying for them every time. Fast it for guidance of Holy Spirit. Let's talk about it again. Mr. Barney, Lucius, Simeon, Mr. Mann, and Saul, whose name changed to Paul. Prophets, apostles, and teachers. Worship. What does worship consist of? Praise. Word. Praise. Prayer. Praise. 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 Offering. Fellowship. Fellowship. Prayer. Word. Prayer. Praise. Or praise. Evangelism. Praise. Offering. Praise. Fellowship, right? We did all of these during study camp today. When do we do word? In the beginning. And then when do we do praise and prayer? Yeah, during praise and prayer time. And then what about evangelism? What evangelism took place today? Oh, yeah, Mr. Victory came. How about offering? We do that on Sundays, and then we offer... We did the Tanzania offering. Fellowship? You guys do, oh, you guys did lots of fellowship today, right? Spending time together with the believers to receive God's guidance. Holy Spirit said, set apart, Paulito and Barney. They placed their hands on them and sent them off from the Church of Antioch. Okay, so that's how they started, worship and prayer. How should we start? Oh, baby Nathan, baby Nathan. How should we start? We should always start with the fundamentals, the basics, right? What's the fundamentals? How are people made? Oh, baby Paul, baby Paul. People are made with salt? People are made with soil? No, people are made to be with God. So we, the fundamentals, we need to be with God. We need to start by knowing what's the true problem. What's the root true problem, fundamental problem? OG, original sin, right? Genesis chapter 3. And what's the answer? Jesus Christ. Right? The problem, the fundamental problem is Genesis chapter 3. Everything started from Genesis chapter 3. And the answer? OJ. What does OJ stand for, Johnny? Orange juice. That a boy. If you said orange juice, I was going to have security escort you out. Orange juice. Get out. Security. Oh, <laughs> You're not security. You're Banshee. All right, so how should we start? 
We got to know Genesis chapter 127, people are creating God's image, happy with God. We need to start everything with God. Or in other words, Emmanuel. What does Emmanuel mean? No, God with us. And we need to start everything with God desire. What does God desire? We, world evangelization, right? Saving lives, saving souls to be with us. We, all, we always need to start with covenant and prayer or worship and prayer, right? What about when you wake up? When you wake up, how can we have a correct start? Any suggestions? Emma. Start with prayer when you, before you even open your eyes, okay? Michael? Too late. Banshki? Prayer journal when you wake up, okay? Michael? Pass. All right, what about in class? How can we have a correct start in class before we even do class, like study camp or even when you go back to school? Banshki? Pray. Emma, deep breathing, okay? How, how else can we have correct start before class? That's it, nobody? All right. No, we start with worship and prayer. Start with prayer before you study. Some people, when they study, they can't even sit still, or they can't concentrate, or they, they stress out and they blame other people that they can't concentrate and finish two IARs today. Right? They, we need to study with spiritual strength, right? So try it out. When you guys get stressed out studying next week, pray for spiritual, spiritual strength, the five powers, and then study, okay? One, one remnant always says, oh, I need to, can I have a mental break? Let me go to the bathroom. I, I need to go to the bathroom to do mental break. That's physical break. One remnant was in the bathroom for like 25 minutes. What about soccer game? Before your soccer game, what do you, well, how, do we, how can we have correct start? Prayer before your soccer game, okay. Anything else? Praise before soccer game, listening to praise even? Well, how else can we have correct start before your soccer game? You have Tarapang on the soccer field? With your teammates? Oh, go for it. What about ice skating? What do we, how can we have correct start before your ice skating competition? Benji? Oh, you do ice skating? Yeah. All right, Benji. How can you have correct start before your ice skating competition? Pray, Emma? Deep breathing, yeah, deep breathing, those cold air conditioned air. All right. What about before you eat? What do we do before we, some remnants don't even wait to pray before we eat. They literally start eating. We're supposed to, pr we pray before we eat. Yeah, Emma? Yeah, we pray before we eat. What else do we do? You wait for the teacher to eat. Oh, some of them, they just start eating, right? What about when you go shopping? When you go shopping, what, what, what should you do even before you even go inside of the supermarket or grocery store? Yeah? Pray before you go into supermarket? Yeah? We praise while walking inside of Walmart? Word <laughs> People are going to think you're crazy. Maybe not Walmart. There are lots of crazy people in Walmart. Michael? Spirituality, you do evangelism camp in Walmart. Oh, what kind of cereal are you buying? Here is gospel, <laughs> gospel <laughs> message. Or you put gospel material, gospel stickers on cereal. <laughs> Blessed are the persecuted, bro. What about before you go and do your talent show or your performance? Some remnants, they do performances, right? <laughs> Or, or what can you do, Emma? Deep breathing. deep breathing, yeah, because you have butterflies in your stomach. You feel nervous. Deep breathing to calm yourself down. 
how can you have a correct start before you watch a show, like a movie? There's, there's some cool movies out these days, right? There's like Jurassic World, there's Thor, there's um, the Minion movie. There was like a huge crowd of teenagers who wore like tuxedos and they all went to watch the, the Minion movie. That's funny. He doesn't fit inside a suit. Yeah, you have correct start by praying before you go to movie theater. Back then, the, there was a huge movie. It was like Batman or something. And then there was a pers person who went inside a movie theater with gun and then shot, at, shot many people in the crowd. It was big news. So we pray before you go to the movie theater. Sometimes in movies, movie theaters, they play very scary, demonic movies, right? So you go to movie theater to break down forces of darkness, right? You pray that the, the projector gets broken. <laughs> They can't watch that. What about before you enter inside of your house? Before you go, so you step inside of your house. Yeah? Pray before you go inside of your house. What else? You, you just open the door to your house. Some, some remnants don't want to go to their house right, to deal with their parents. What about before you go to sleep? What can you do before you go to sleep? To correct start before you go to sleep. Emma? Prayer journal before you go to sleep? All right, go for it. What about you? You pray before you go to sleep? All right. How about you? Prayer journal. Smile. Mike. <laughs> Mike, there's this one remnant who just smiles randomly. He's doing IXL? And he starts smiling. He's doing IAR testing. Serious test. And he just starts smiling. Oh, blessed, precious remnant. What about before you do video games? What can you do before you do video games? Yeah? You pray? It's like you start everything with prayer, huh? Pinball machine? Jesus, Jesus' life. Bing, 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 bing. I went to arcade, and then I lost. <laughs> right. Or you guys have play um, what is it? Nintendo. Yeah, so one remnant brought their Nintendo Switch today, and then we were playing. They were playing. We should we should connect it to here and play here. Okay, Mario Kart. You guys go down. Toad, toad, toad. Donkey Kong, Donkey Kong. What about before you go play in the park? Before you go play in the park? Okay, maybe not this park. <laughs> it's scary. You're going to get eaten. Oh, yeah, before you go to the park to play with your friends or go, just go up there by yourself to just go on the swings. <laughs> Emma? Okay, deep breathing because you're outside. Yeah. What else can you do before you go to the park? Like there's playground here. Sometimes during activity time, we go to playground, right? One remnant broke the swing with his big butt. And he screamed across the entire playground, did you just I broke the swing? No, you can think about evangelism, right? This is public park, so many people in the neighborhood come. So it's a chance for evangelism, right? Yeah, what about before you, you drive? Vroom, vroom. Before you go drive, because there's lots of crazy people on the road, right? You gotta pray. Dangerous. Who knows when you could get into a car accident, right? You pray before you go drive. When we drive, it's, um, lots of our spiritual problems kick, come out, right? Someone cuts you off, and then your lovely mother, who's always nice and smiling, all, 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 all of a sudden turns into gangster. You beep, 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 beep. Yeah. So pray even before we go somewhere. So in conclusion, everything that we do, we need to start with yeah, prayer, worship and prayer, right? We start with Jesus' life, Jesus' power, 
He's healing as Jesus' witnesses. Platform, watch our antenna. What was homework this week? Post the, the Beatitudes, the eight blessings. No. Some people already did it. That's your, that's your homework. Who is this? The Beatitudes. <laughs> Good job, Pastor All right. What about, who is this? Chloe. Chloe. Okay, Chloe did her homework. Who is this? Oh, yeah. The Ocho Beatitudes? Okay, the eight. Okay. Oh, in Spanish, verse, verse tres, verse cuatro. Ver okay. Oh, you saw in advance that Victor was going to come today. Victor speaks Spanish, Espanol. Where, where is your... Oh, you didn't finish. You only did like four of them. Hey, okay, you got to finish it. Maybe you can finish it. You take it home today. It's, in, it's posted in my room. Don't just... You just put it on the brick wall and left. Okay, let's pray for Tajikistan and Portugal. Islam, Roman Catholic. Let's pray for these two nations. I think one of them is a soccer team, right? So there is this... The new, new Vic, Mr. Victory who came today, he's pretty good at soccer. Yeah. Him and Sam, pretty kind of equal. Maybe he's, maybe he's a little better than Sam. No. no? <laughs> Sam looked like he went swimming after Jim. <laughs> All right. Three, two, one. Dear God, may you bless Tajikistan and Portugal so that the gospel may enter and revive these nations. May disciples arise, shine the light of the gospel, and establish a kingdom there. In the name of Jesus Christ we pray. Amen. Dear God, thank you so much for these blessed remnants. Help us to start everything with Emmanuel, worship, and prayer. In the name of Jesus Christ we pray. Amen.